got really lucky that went off of his heel. And What's happening everybody? Matthew Snow is the Gold Crease Guardian. We are starting off another Friday Night Doubleheader with this one. Let's go to the video. Alright, so some of the guys from Sunday have another team in the Friday Night League. They needed a goalie. They asked me. I said yes. So I'm playing for Idle Wild in this one before my game with the Polar Bears on this night. Um, hoping to do a little bit better than the last time out against Lucent. We'll see how this goes. Well, we've had a quick offensive start so far. Ooh, that was a tricky little bounce there. Um, two goals right away. That's always nice to have. Give you a little bit of a cushion in net. Maybe gives you a little bit of confidence to just go out there and make some saves. Good stick. Every once in a while, I do get a stick on a puck. Oh, man. I just poke checked a little bit late. Not really late, but just missed my poke check. Wasn't really in a position to push over if I missed it, and he scored. Is what it is. Bad decision on my part, really. I should just play the like in that drive. Good two saves on the breakaway. Really nice. It's tough when they get that rebound right away on a breakaway like that to just be able to get something on it, but kicking that leg out is good, and I'm glad he didn't get a shot off there because my foot just straight up slipped out from under me. Lots of saves early on. Lots of pucks to the net. Couple of second and third tries as well. Not bad. is clicking on all cylinders for us tonight. That's never a bad thing. Um, stinks to be the guy at the other end sometimes in that case, but nice to have some offense going. Really, really nice to have some offense going. I don't think he was happy with that because his helmet strap came undone. Unfortunately for goalies, the rule is actually that it doesn't have to be blown down if the helmet strap comes undone, at least in the U.S. I think in certain places in Canada, they actually blow the whistle if the puck hits the goalie in the head at all, but that's just not the case for us here. So, is what it is for him there. Tough break, really. Never like to see that, but up five to one after one. That is not a bad start. Uh, pretty good by me. A few really good saves and um, just solid back there. Trying to, and you can see right here, another one that he almost gets a rebound on. Trying to be very calm and patient and committed to uh, being in the right spots. That's what I really thrive on, is just good positioning and reading the play. And so if I can do those things, usually I have a pretty solid outing and I've started it off here doing exactly that. Lots of head checks too. This is a really nice stick on this one. Get that puck up and away. They get to the rebound, but there's no immediate threat on the rebound, which is kind of the point there. And then a really nice stop on the tip and cover, just controlling the puck again. Uh, that's always something that I kind of try to deal with um, is, you know, getting sticks on pucks down low because I'm not always that good at it. So. You can see there I kind of reached for one I didn't need to. But just want to create as many as many opportunities for me to control those rebounds as I possibly can. Oh, we got a Zegris attempt. That was close, huh? 
heads up by the defenseman to uh, get get his glove on that one. Um, you know, can't fault him for trying. I arguably waited too long to make that pass. I got lucky that he handled that so well and bailed me out because that was that was not the best pass for me to make in that situation. But you know, I was kind of just feeling like I would do something there. Ooh, tried the Forsberg, did not get it. That one seems to be popular in the last couple of videos. This is great too, look at this. Puck comes through, get a stick on it, pop it. That guy in front is now no longer a threat on the rebound. The rebound comes from outside of a scoring area and I'm already sealed up. If that puck had stayed on the ice, it would have been a problem. Kind of like this play was almost a problem. I get a little wandery as he goes and dishes this to the middle and got really lucky that went off of his heel and then my defenseman was able to uh, clear that away. But, you know, that stick save demonstrated the importance of getting that rebound up in the air uh, in situation because it creates a, a chance for me or doesn't create a chance for them, rather. That's what I meant to say. You know, sometimes it's hard to put words together, and yet I do this. Anyway, through two, we're up big. Um, at this point, just trying to stay focused here, because that is something that I've always kind of struggled with. There always seems to be one weird goal that goes in on me um, that just really has no business going in because it's a big lead or something like that, so. You know, just trying to do a little bit better at that. This is a good stop too, as he drove the net and actually went back against the grain with that. Relatively good idea, especially because it came soft off of my pad and there was there were people crashing, so there could have been that chance for the rebound, but there just wasn't. Nice again, just as he drove over there, really nice. Oh, that's a goal. What did I say about trying to stay focused? This is just a two on all that kind of gets away from everyone. Good pass, good finish. Not much I'm gonna do there. Just, just kind of funny that they always seem to find a way to get another one. I don't know what it is, but I mean, still playing really well in this one. I'm still very happy with my play, two on all notwithstanding. Sneaky little shot here, a good chicken wing save, getting my elbow out and just getting a piece of it. Um, mostly because I just had, that puck came kind of around a screen and I was not really on it. Um, so it was kind of a last second chicken wing. In reality, I could have been a little bit more square to that, that stick and it probably would have hit me in the chest and been a non-issue. But a good save still um, on, a, on a tough play. Here's another breakaway, here we go. <laughs> if you've seen my older videos, I have a problem with this move sometimes. So he tries the no move, no dice at all. I, I was all over it. The ref found that to be hysterical. By the way, this, this ref over here on the left, I uh, just thought that that was great, that a team that was that was down and in this situation went for it. I mean, might as well have a little fun when you're, when you're down a couple of goals. And I'm just happy that I made the save on it because like I said, had issues with that one. Really nice, solid, big win there. Love to see that kind of stuff. Always good. Always, always feels good. Well, there we go. A good, solid outing, big win. 10 to 2, 25 saves on 27 shots. That's a pretty good effort for me. One goal saved above average, again, or above expected. Again, very good, very solid, doing what I needed to do, controlling plays. It was everything I wanted to build some confidence coming out of a tough outing against Lucent. Um, and a kind of slow start to my season this year. So, really happy to kind of get that under my belt 
And it sets up something huge coming next Friday to the channel. What is potentially the greatest game I've ever played in my life. Um, a game that you are not going to want to miss. So to make sure that you don't, if you have not already, please head down below, hit the subscribe button, ring that notification bell. You'll want to know when I'm uploading videos because next Friday's video, the Sunday night game for the Polar Bears, is just something else. It's spectacular. I cannot wait to bring it to, to you. So I really hope that you go down and hit that subscribe button. Maybe leave a like button on or a like on this video as well so that more people can see the channel. I'm pushing for a thousand subscribers and I really want to get there soon. So every little bit helps. And if you're interested, there's also the link to my merch and Backstop Hockey's merch in the description. All of that's down there for you to check out. And I'll see everybody for the next video.